Dave Carr, I'm a Unite member. I'm a critical care nurse working in one of central London's uh, biggest hospitals, currently looking after the COVID-19 patients. They're the sickest patients, the patients on ventilators. What I'd like to say to, to you guys in, in construction is that, well, is that it's a joke at the moment when we're being told by the police um, to, to break up if we're in groups in parks. Um, we're being told by uh, the Prime Minister and Matt Hancock. We're being instructed by Matt Hancock to stay at home. Queues at the supermarket are being kept two metres apart. People are wearing masks in the street. And yet you guys in construction and a lot of other non-essential industry are working as normally. You can't keep safe distance in a place like a building site where you need to look out for each other's safety. You can't keep safe distance when you're in your, your canteens or in your minibuses coming to and from work, when you're clocking in, when you're clocking out at the end of the shift. So what we're saying as health workers is you need to think about yourselves. You need to think about your family. You need to think about the impact of you or any of your family or friends getting sick on the NHS at the moment. Currently in the NHS, we've moved from 850 critical care beds in London to 8,000 critical care beds. That gives you an idea of the scale of this, of this disease. And let me tell you, this virus doesn't discriminate. It's taken out the young, it's taken out the old, and it's taken out everyone in between, including people that are fit without any comorbidities. In some of the units in this country, there aren't patients above the age of 50. So no one is immune from this. The best way you can ensure your health is by not being at work. If you look at what's been happening in the health service, we've already lost four doctors and five nurses to this disease because of PPE. Perhaps some of that PPE that you're using could be donated to us um, where we're short of it. Um, we've also lost 4,000 members of the public um, and that toll is likely to rise. So if you want to make, um, if you want to take the pressure off of the NHS and if you want to make a difference in the fight against this virus, you need to shut down your sites, you need to shut them down now and um, you need to shut them down for the duration of this, th this virus. If you're worried about your finances, this is when you need to put pressure on your unions. Um, if they can bail out the bankers, they can certainly bail out construction workers um, who are currently not essential um, to, 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 the, to the battle against this virus. Good luck, down tools, go home, stay safe, and um, we'll see you on the other side.